Hello everyone, it's Brett here, Lionheart84, and uh, just the reason I'm doing this quick video, I'm looking at my pineapple guava of the variety Nikita, and also known as a Fijawa. And the reason um, this one uh, merited a video, I noted that one of my American friends and subscribers, he's um, he's done quite a long uh, vlog on. Uh, in the forums on the development of his uh, pineapple guavas and the, the one the varieties he's growing and which ones fruit and which ones don't and I note that in some of his reports he seems to have had no success in getting the flowers to set fruit on his Nikita for some reason or other they always seem to get uh, to the point where the flowers just abort once it gets to about uh, I think late August, early September, and the fruits never swell. And yet, for whatever reason, my I've had no trouble with fruit set on my Nikita. These are way past the stage where they're likely to drop off. There are one or two <coughs> flowers on it that um, obviously haven't set. Um, probably flowers that came later. Um, even that one there appears to have set. But I've got about probably at least a. A dozen or more fruits on it that um, are still quite small as we're only in the third week of uh, August but they certainly look as if they're likely to progress to an edible size and yet the strange thing is next to it <coughs> there is a unique I think the variety is let's just check the label unique which <coughs> was absolutely covered in flowers and I believe is one of the ones that is considered to be self-fertile and I suppose it probably had 30 or 40 flowers on it and yet despite the fact that it was it's next to two other pineapple guavas including the Nikita and <coughs> I think the other one might be a Coolidge or an Apollo has not set one single fruit which seems bizarre uh, the plant next to it seems to have a few small fruits on it. Perhaps it's because I've had it under these other trees and it didn't get enough sun. But I did hand pollinate the flowers. But it's interesting because Unique's one that normally has no trouble setting. And yet my um, Nikita, which has a reputation for not setting fruit, is, has got absolutely plenty of reasonable embryo fruits on it. Um, you can see, see that we're clearly going to get a decent crop I believe it's not a particularly large fruit I'm not sure <clears throat> if there are any uh, particular characteristics Nikita has I'm really studying them whether or not it's got a different flavor or it's earlier or later um, or uh, has other some other bonus it's got the odd obviously fruit that there were still dropping off which have set which were very late flowers but I'm fairly sure I'm gonna get a reasonable crop off it as well as some of my other varieties so that was for um, the gentleman in uh, I think he's north right up in North America near the border um, I'll have to have a look and see maybe Seattle area where the climate can be quite similar to ours but I thought he might possibly see this video and be interested that uh, Nikita is setting fruits for me here in the UK anyway thanks for watching the video much appreciated of course please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel share the video if you think anybody will be interested in it and of course click on the bell if you'd like updates on new videos as they come out including of course progress of these embryo fruits on this Nikita I'll see you on the next video Brett out for now